Hey, folks. Oh, blueberries. Mmm. Since last episode, I... Well, I've taken all the trees off this island. Also, I needed to let you know a few episodes ago, and I forgot, that one island way back wherever, where I had cut down all the trees but left the stumps, and I thought one had grown back. Turns out it probably was just a tree that I missed, because nothing ever grew back. So, you've got to plant them if you want new trees. But, since last episode, I got a few comments from both Nico and Alley Cat pretty much straightening me out on how sales work. Since then, I've taken a little time to think about things and figure it out. And, yeah, I never really noticed that blue circle there. Yes, there's a graphic over there making it very obvious, but I didn't look over there. I was concentrating here and trying to figure out what that orange triangle on the side means. So, yeah, what, okay. Uh, the the sail wiggles back and forth within that orange zone, but I never really saw the center enough to, to where it really made sense. The island w wants to go that way, and so that's really the front of the island there. And you swing it around so that you're built in the right direction according to the front of the island. Now, I don't know if that changes if you put the helm somewhere else, it probably does, but I guess that's one way of finding out where the island was supposed to be, you know, aimed at as far as where to put the helm. But let's drop into the helm. Helm doesn't give you a hint. You just drop it wherever you want. So if we were to put the helm over here on this little island just to try it. Can I? Can I have two helms? I cannot. Oh, I need planks. Oh, I'm not on my own island, so I can't just draw from things. Uh... Yeah, let's go grab some planks. I want to find out what happens there. Uh, upstairs. Here, I thought I was all ready for this episode. <laughs> uh, we'll grab half of that. What else would I possibly need? Let's grab, since I'm not going to be on my own island. No, don't do that. Grab, stop that. <laughs> Put you in there. And rope is probably going to be a thing, so half of you. And I've already got some logs. I don't have any rocks, so I shouldn't need any. Also, I got to thinking, this guy, you know, the, your equipment draws automatically from these. Do these have them? I don't have any baskets up here anymore. Right there. They do, so they should be able to draw from that, right? Yeah, I'm all over the place right now. If I wanted to make a, oh, something that I don't have parts for, bone arrow. Okay, yeah, I don't think I have that on me right now, but it's grabbing it. Right? Yeah, that's not on me, so that does work. Okay. I've been watching other people's videos lately, and they were older versions, and apparently long ago, the baskets didn't feed anything. And so... Wow, they're already flowering again. So the wild ones grow a lot faster than the uh, domesticated ones. So if I were to put this guy out over here, <clears throat> instead of <clears throat> over here where the sail wanted to go, now we have a new head of the island, right? Sail? Yep, now it's saying it wants to be built that direction instead of out that direction. Okay. So had we not built all that and put the sail in first, we may have found that the front of the island was way out over there instead of over here where we're using it. Another thing I found out is that this sail over here, he goes the other direction. He's like the rudder. As to catch wind that comes in from the side that this guy won't catch because it would have just blown parallel with him. So multiple sails do, you know, different sails do different things. Anyway, this island I just stripped all the parts off of, and I don't know if it's going to yell at me later if I leave this here and say, no, sorry, that's on another island now. You can't right, you can't fly this one. Can I? Yeah, I don't need to be out of that mode. Okay. So, over here, I don't know that... That, well, Nico had made a comment that things blocking the sails will not allow wind to blow in. Just like trees and, you know, a big old house. So, maybe I do want to rebuild out over at the other end. Hmm. Too bad we can't dig. I build a, 
an escape tunnel <laughs> from the house underneath and pop up into the uh, the command deck over there. Anyway, we are yeah crouch down. Nope, that's not a crouch. Right there. That doesn't help. We need a middle view, a middle distance there. So the sails are over there, but we are actively going this direction. So we're pointed, the point of the arrow there, a point of the ship, which is probably, now that I think about it, that guy up there, that's kind of the shape that, you know, the, the ship symbol in the middle is probably the same shape as that guy right there. And I just assume that my island must be long and pointed, but not necessarily. It just could be the way that the map does it now yeah. so if that's the case we want to turn to our right turn towards starboard and pull away from this am i touching out over here where am i at i'm pretty close i can't back up so let's just see what happens scrape what was that the, the movie star trek that the newer series of star trek was it that the one where they kind of... No, 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 I'm thinking of that other one. Galaxy Quest, where they just scraped their way out of Starport? Yeah. Anyway, we've turned. Did we turn here? I think we did. Yep, we're heading that way. So we are heading to see what these guys are. So are those the first two flashy thingies yeah pretty much though it's possible these are closer let's kind of head into the middle of all of them to see what pops up on the screen first kind of over like that okay leave you running let's see if we can watch this new tile drop in yeah, that's going to be a little while okay so we need to find more corrupted aisles we need to take our new coated weapons and find more of the thing that's not in here. The damaged or undamaged samples. <laughs> and see if we can't get up to 70 so we can run the research table one more time. I think we're finally... there it is. And there's essentially nothing in front of us. We've got to turn starboard a little further and catch those three over there so we're seeing the flashes from way over here so let's turn into here and maybe dive into the next ring so we're gonna skip those skip those we're heading this way and I already see I think the outline of one of those islands or something there is I'm seeing something in front of one of the flashes We'll see. So does that feel right? Around. I gotta redesign this thing. Yeah. Yep, we're heading the right direction. Should be just barely to our left when, or to our right when we get there. Yeah, maybe. Well, we'll see how busy I am in the next couple of days. Definitely by this weekend, I'm gonna tear this whole command deck apart and rebuild it. No, I was seeing these guys coming in. No, not the islands. Okay. One of these must have been right in front of the one of the flashes. So, off to our right. So that one must not be real either. But there's two there. I think it's these three here that are real. Heading in front of us. Boy, the music's getting real excited now. Yeah, there's a couple of them to our left. Which must be these two. And we're seeing these guys off to the right. Okay. So, timing wise, we've got a ways to go. Let's slow this down to about three quarter. And what else can we do? We haven't visited the animals for a while. A couple of episodes. So let's dive off here. And go see how these guys are doing. Clean up their messes. And say hi to, well, pick up Jeremy, and then we can feed now. So we can't say hi 
There's no pet until you feed them. Ah, they're not in a happy mood till you feed them. Okay, let's feed them. So, pick one of you up and one of you up. Oops, wrong one. <laughs> Ten, you didn't see that. Drop you. Oh, we can put 20 in here now, huh? Okay, used to be, a, I thought it was a max of 10. So, drop 20 in each. Sit back and watch the dinner rush. <laughs> oh, they ran around the other side to, to cheat and put their head through the wall, right? Now they're coming back. Oh, I saw a head sneak through the wall over there. I guess I need... Oh, he got excited. I guess I need to... Uh, pet. To move those away from the wall a little bit. There we go. Yep, that's what I was trying to do. Okay, so let's go talk to the pheasants. Do I have feet on me? I do. Okay. Now, there he is. I thought I had lost, also, the little goat. I cannot walk up into there without the stairs. The little goat was right here. I thought, oh no, another one's gone. But that's the black one right there, so he grew up. That's why he's not little anymore. The pheasant, though, I don't know what happened there. I laid him down right here, and he wasn't there the next episode. But let's run over here and see these pheasants and grab a pumpkin. And we probably should go collect the flax. All right, so let's clean up all of this mess. Got to be just the right angle to pick those up. Okay, grab that. And when I see feathers and no egg I t like this, I think the egg despawns a little faster than the feathers, I'm guessing. Because I see that quite often, but the feathers always seem to be under an egg. But that's a good load of feathers. You, you would use feathers for making arrows, so I can see a reason to maybe not have the, the feathers despawn quite as fast. Let's put all... Well, let's pull that back. Um, pull that back. Let's save a few in case we need to feed somebody. Actually, they're all running out that way. Remember that last time? They all found a way. Yeah, they all want to go there. Okay, let's go move this to a new place. Getting laggy again. Um, Nico wrote in to correct me an episode or two ago. It's not that everything on the island is moving. It's when the island itself is moving that causes a lot of lag. And we are sailing right now, and we're down to... 17 frames per second, so that's probably what it is. Should I put this in a different place? Um, and how close are we to crashing into something over there? Okay, you pop you out, put you in uh, right in front of things and closer to that door and away from all the walls. So let's uh, split you and drop you in and see if anybody gets the cue to walk through that itty bitty little door again. No, they're all running to the side. One of them figured it out last time and then after a while they were all in here. Okay. Maybe we are having a little bit of a bottleneck here. Let's pull you out as well. And we'll put another staircase there in case they need that to get through. Build stairs. Uh, automatic, and, no, nope, drop you in right there. Okay, does that help you guys? Mm, no. Okay, let's pull the torch out and the roof out. And does that help you guys? Still can't quite get in there, but boy, they know where it is. Come on, you can do it. Give it a try, Micah. Nope. Come on, Connor. You can do it. Come on, just give you a little kick. Nope. <laughs> hmm. Okay, well, let's... I can't... I can pick up Connor and take him in and drop him off, and maybe he will... That wasn't Connor. That was Micah. Maybe he will lure the other ones in. Um... Oh, you figured it out. Yep, there's food in there, and there's... Still ten, so you were the only one to eat so far. Well, we'll give them 
time to figure out their priorities, but I need to know if we're getting closer to some new islands over here. Yep, there's something. Okay, let's head up top and see where we're at. The wind is blowing, or the the, the uh, windmill is turning. Nope, that's a rock. Okay, that was a big rock. So we, we're close though. It's right in front of us and barely to the right. No, that is an island right there. Okay, a little bit to the left on this one. Okay, let me get a better angle here. Right there. No, it is to the left on this side. Over here. Okay, as we're getting closer, it's looking right. Okay, that does look corrupted, too. The other two are just not in view yet. Let's look up to the right edge and see if they appear. No. Okay, let me see that again. It's in the next sector. Maybe that's still too far away to see. So, it's right on the, the border between them. But I'm thinking it's... Is there one in there, too? That's one flash. There's three flashes there. There's two right there. Yeah, it's hard to tell distance. It is. Let's go ahead and kick our sails up to full. And we'll head over here a little bit. And You've got to bump out the side, kind of like the island with the tunnel underneath and the goats on top. I wonder if we're going to find some, uh, some poor little goats. In which case, I'm going to probably have to start healing them on their own islands once we get the cure done, because we're going to run out of room. There's too much goat poo down there already. No, I think that island... Well, it might be. I still can't quite tell. I can say this is looking a little big, but... It could be similar. Okay. So, off to the side a little. And slow down and drop. Slow down more. Only one node in there. Alright, something like that. Let's get a little closer and call this one done. Grab some sleep, bring the sun back. There we go. And steer that way. I think we're all zeroed out now. Yeah. Lots of sparklies. Okay. Let's go grab some sleep. Check our tools. Get some pumpkin pie. And probably don't really need the pumpkin pie for one node. But it might surprise me. I don't know how many nodes you've got to take down before maybe even more powerful monsters show up. If that is a thing. So... There are more monsters planned. I just don't know at what point they're going to suddenly appear. <laughs> like the furniture. Alright, so tool-wise, is there any kind of rating system? You are coded and good for another 20 points or something like that. Not that I can tell. But you've got two symbols here. And we've got... Oh! It's a raindrop. Okay, so there's the, the amount that's left on the weapon. Okay, well that helps out a lot. Good. So you can tell when you're about to run out. Um, yeah, let's let's go for a, for a treat here. We'll take you, and we will throw another one of you in. Cool. And I've still got water on me. I do. And got a few, a few spaces for seeds left. All right, so with that, we're good. Sword's ready. Oops. One. Jump, 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 jump. There we go. We're good. All right, hit up in here and slow down. Back up higher. It immediately fogs over when you get too low. All right, I'm not seeing any red caps in there. I'm really not. I'm seeing a lot of animals, though. A lot of animals that are cocooned. But no... Well, there might be one red cap right there in front of me. Okay. So we'll settle down over on this end and then go find him. Something like that. 
Hello. Oh, missed you. Okay. Good there. Bones? No. I wish I can get bones out of those guys. That would be a nice bonus. Take you. Alright. Take you guys out and let's clear off all of the grab you all of the other enemies like these guys. Alright, just held it and hit them nice and powerfully. In fact, if I just hold it I'm all ready to go. Oh, that's an idea. I wonder if the charge will run out. Huh. You? Dude! Okay. That's three. How are we doing here? My charge is... Hey, I heard noises. Okay, we're at... I wonder if the charge does run out. Meaning, holding it in preparation may prematurely discharge it. Hmm. So, in that case, let's grab a three and clear you guys out without using up the potion. Okay, what are you? You're a rock. And then go back to one. Actually, three. No, I might get... I don't know if I get anything out of taking this down. I've never looked up there. No, I guess we don't. Okay. You and you. That didn't work. Well, kind of did. All right. So, injured. What do we got now? Ten more. I don't remember what I needed. Hopefully it's enough. We're going to get more when we take this out. Is there any chance there's any more of them? If there is, I want to take them down before they all vanish. So let's just wander through and see if I can get anybody else upset and want to attack me. We lost a bunch of them last time when they just fell off the side of the island. Nobody in here? No, nope. it appears that I've done my job. Okay, let's take this out. Okay, so now we've got 16. So let's learn this guy. Wool Tapestry. We need a sheep for that. Okay, before I find out what's in all of these, let's go see if we have enough to make the potion. It'd be kind of nice to cure them right here on the island. And out of curiosity, is there anything that looks like it would be a great place for a stone chest? I don't think so. Hmm. Let's grab that. That. If it was going to be somewhere, it would probably be in here. And that doesn't look like it's likely to be. So, pop you and put you back in. Yeah, you're probably not. Alright, so let's head back to wherever back is. That way. And let's go to the research table and see how close we are. May have to venture on a little bit further. Okay, uh, need the first floor. Okay, so we've got 62, we've got 78. Cool. I think we're there. So that is this guy. Yeah, 75? I thought it was 70 last time. Did that change on me? <laughs> Yeah, what, what version is this? Okay, so this has a third little ridge on it. Hmm. Now, I thought the one that was over the sick animals out there had only the two ridges. You know, that shape there. Interesting. Well, let's pop this in and the rest of these just in case they're needed. And this one? Yeah, so we'll put this in here. And garlic. And let's work on making these up. And then if we have to, we'll make a bunch of Tier 1s to make some more Tier 2s to make more Tier 3s. Alright. Now, does this just coat a weapon, or is it actually going to do us some good? Did I not pick you up? There we go. So what does it say? 
it doesn't. There we go. Must be applied on an upgrade station. Deal a lot more damage to corrupted monsters and gather destroyed samples from them. Same description. So this still doesn't help our animals? If not, this is really a long... There it is. Okay. So, what have we got? Hello, Nolan. How you do? I should get some food, huh? Why don't you, why don't you just wait there a moment? Yeah, you're, you're probably hungry. So, pop a couple of those. And... Where'd you go? <laughs> um... Dude... Did you head straight into where the food was? You did. Okay, let's um, let's pick you up. What? Oh, I fed you. Okay. How you doing? Oh, we can shear you. Yeah. Now let's let's do this. There we go. Mm -hmm. Okay. Pick you up. Put you in here for now, and drop you off, and. Everybody make Nolan feel at home. All right, so what do we have in here? We had a Nolan. We have a... A Robert. How you doing, dude? We've got a... Owen. And... Alejandro. Cool. Okay, let's feed... Get back, dudes. There, there's food over here. There's food over here. I know there's food over here. <laughs> All right. Fed you. Let's feed you. And right over here. Okay. All right. Pick you up. Put you in here. Drop you off. And same thing. That's a branch. Okay. Same thing here. Put you in. Bye. And one more. Our sheep. So we've got to think about a sheep pen. And decide whether the sheep and llamas or alpacas share. Since they all get sheared. So that would make it a little bit easier if they were all together. Okay, now what I was wondering about, I hate to tear this all apart, but we don't need this structure anymore. Is there a chance that our pheasant exists somehow underneath the floorboard? Is it possible to fall through? No. So I don't know what happened to Mr. Pheasant. We had a sick pheasant. Unless that was a dream. And you're all thinking that I'm crazy. Okay, so you guys are done. I have five cures left. Let's go see what's on the island. As far as animals that I can cure and leave behind. And is this island a... Let's go down a bit. No, you're not the same one that had the goats on top. Okay. So let's drop in here. we got... A second learning stone we do okay but let's peek into here just bones and we've got a sheep so let's cure you Ariana and let's pet you and let's pick up so I guess I fed I didn't feed hmm you didn't wake up hungry. Maybe I missed a step there. Anyway, we got, I see purple up here. So, let's see you. We've got a cure. And we've got a pet. So, I guess when they're not on your own island, they don't need to be fed. Hmm. Anyway, let's Grab the flax and the corn and the flax and we'll go and 
and see what's in that learning stone. Oh, we got more. You, now that we got the cure, we've got a much higher rate of success as far as uh, these guys not uh, just being a pile of bones. Interesting. Grab you. That works. Just spin and spam. Spin and spam. <laughs> there, there. Grab all of these guys. Is there anything else around here that flags me as odd or different? Don't, don't do it. Don't do it. Okay. You. Get a few more of these guys. These are quick, easy supplies. I don't have to sit there and chop. Don't have to chase the logs off the side of the of the island. They just fall right into your pouch. And while I'm doing it, I'm finding all these things. So, good plan here. All right. You hiding a goat. All right, let's go see what's down below. Oh, more corn over here. Grab you you guys first. There, there. And a couple more. Okay. What you got? You stop screeching at me. That's not the right one. Okay. Where is below? I've lost below. There's below. And now we've got a stone foundation. Ooh, I like that. So maybe our command deck needs a stone foundation. Wonder if stone foundation means stone floors. Ooh, we have a third category now. Oh, look at that. Walls too? Stone walls. No walls for windows, but I guess that you would use wood for for the window part and stone so this is the basement level mm hmm okay so grab you you're also getting dark clean off the rest of this so we've accomplished that major goal learn how to cure the animals only took what 13 episodes at an hour apiece <laughs> But then I did take my time to and explore and build and try all the things. Okay, so we're doing pretty good. I got a different color there. No. Nope. So I think we're kind of done. One last tree over here. And one right there. All right. Jumping off? I think so. Put seven away. And pop in here. And let's clean up the mess over here uh, some are shadows and some aren't there's one that's a shadow okay we're here we'll turn all this into soil figure out what's going to happen with the uh, the new command deck and whatever is left maybe we'll put into more garden space okay let's go bring the sun back let's start by Getting, see, can I hop? I can. Getting a little closer to the next island. Um, next sector? Next sector. Let's try to get to those guys. So just off to our right. Actually, it's right there. Uh, do that. And we'll turn it down. Just go real slow. Well, I guess if we go at all, we're going to drop our frames a second so I'm out of it I'm not moving at all and yeah they're slowly building back up again now 30 40 50 60 as soon as I start to go 30 20s yeah okay well that's it that that explains it right there so that's why last time when I just started to rotate was all that it took and everything started getting real laggy okay well um before we head over there then, I wanted to play with these guys a bit. So if overlapping is a problem, let's see that. Um, full sail, 
an F. Okay, so the guy in front's not getting anything. Is that what the red means? I took that as... Well, am I spinning? No. Oh, I'm hitting. Oops. I'm hitting that way, but I'm, I'm now... Uh, yeah, what's that called? Strafing. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> anyway, I took red as bad, meaning it's not... There's something... It's, it's being damaged or something. But maybe it just means that it's not working. Because it's not getting any wind. Let's find out. If I were to get rid of you... Uh, we'll do that. You and you. And then forward. F. They're a little happier, aren't they? Hmm... There's still a little overlap in there. Oh, that's something else that that Nico had mentioned. I'm missing a step in building these sails. So let's see if we can figure that part out. So this guy, I want to build you here. But there is apparently three steps, not two. So there is the initial up there. And then there is, he said, both height and width. So I guess I think I'm too close. Let's go over here. Can we see it better? So we could go... Oh, so we've got that direction. As well as that direction. Okay. So we could just make it wide. Or we could get back down to the ground again and make it huge. Okay. Takes up... Hello. Incoming. There they are. Okay. Compared to these guys, yeah, there'd be a lot more in there. I got them backwards, didn't I? Yep, I did, because I spun around or something. I guess I had to set at that other island. Okay. Okay, pop you out. So forward is there, so we've got to spin you around to there. Out there. Up as far as you'll go to give us height. Over. And down. Now we got sails that we can't walk around. But we've got some serious sails there now. Okay. Now that makes a lot more sense. We're not going forward, right? Uh, He is fully deployed. Is that just because? Nope, I'm going forward. Okay, stop that. We're probably long past the island, aren't we? Hmm. Yep, long past. He's over there now. All right, let's turn around. Whoop. Up, the other up, the other down. <laughs> okay, hop in and let's turn just enough to keep turning and forward just enough to give us some movement. Let's quickly go build another sail while that's happening. So, build you, get rid of you, put you back in. You're aimed. Almost the right direction. Let's go to manual or disabled. Put you there. Spin you around so the white arrow is on top of the blue arrow. Right there. Hit that. Up. Over. And down. Gotcha. Full sails. Now we're coming around slowly. Two islands over there. And neither are corrupted. Now that guy over there, over on the far right that disappears when I look at it, he must be in the next sector. Oh, okay, so we're going to... Now, later I'm going to have these sails up on a, on a second deck, so they're not going to be in our way. But heading over to here, we're about to pop another ring. So there must be an island just off into the next ring there that we can't see on the map yet. Okay, but let's stop our our spin that way and just slowly work our way toward him while I'm working on these. So I'm thinking we want this guy brought forward. Yeah. So you get rid of you, bring you up here so you're further away from him. And boy, that width... We'll try here. Spin you around like so. 
We'll see if that's far enough away. Up. Over. Down. Didn't. There you go. Something like that. Okay. So. Mmm. Yeah. Building full size is going to be a little cumbersome until I get this deck rebuilt. Um, but that now, full, nope, full sail and F. Looks pretty good here, but I can't see the other one. 24! Hey, big number. That must mean something good. Okay, we're happy by 24 this time. Okay, so let's just barely turn you back on. Let's build another one of those right over here. Though maybe I won't... I'll keep it at head height so I can get under it. Build. You. Here. Out over here. And... Turn you a little bit. Yeah, about like so. Seems to be a happy spot. All the way up. All the way out. And down only most of the way this time. Okay. Yeah, that works. Now, can I... I can I can get under you, right? Yeah. Okay. So, I also wanted... Do I have time? Yeah, we're creeping in real slow. I want to build a couple of these guys that are perpendicular to. So, move you something like that. You're over there. You're over there. I think this one is safe right here. All the way up. And you... We'll make as long as we can, and as high as we can. I think we can walk around you. Okay, so let's do the same thing over here. You're this direction, and you are as well. So let's do one of each and see what the difference is. So I want you... Which one are you? You're that pole right there. So, I suppose you're something like that. Up. Over. Oh, I clicked twice. Try that again. Over and drop. Then click. Okay. So, let's see what this looks like now. Um, use F. Full. Takes us up to 20 knots. We're red in the back. I can't, unfortunately, turn around and see what's behind me. So the guy in the back's a little angry right now. Let's spin you around 22 knots. Much faster we've been going last time. Like, let's just slow that down. I'm going to miss this guy completely. All right. So we'll spin in here, really just to get him in view. Don't have to get too close. We'll check underneath this guy and see if there is access under... As well, a cavern or something. Slow you down, drop in, and pull out. Okay, so the guy in the middle is not working. I think we just eliminate him. Or do we do something different? A third one of these? Maybe. Let's see how long that is. So you spin you around like so. All the way up. All the way out. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna hit, aren't we? We'll leave you there. Okay. So with that, what do we got? Let's get rid of some inventory. Let's go see what's over here before it starts to rain on us. Okay. Whoops. Oh. Gotcha. Pheasants. Okay. And a learning stone. We've got a patterned rug. Ooh, that's nice. So, got some pheasants over here. Rocks. Just because. And what else do we have? Okay. Didn't like that little hop, huh? I think that's island music. No? That's another learning stone. Fall all the way down. Wow. 
Got a nice little pond over here. So this is the same island that we've seen before. Two entrances into... This is where I found Connor. Because I dropped him off right here. And then went in between episodes. And then I picked him up and wanted to put him back over where I found him. Which I think was up on this rock. But I had to carry him and I couldn't get up here. So I just dropped him off down over here and started filming. But I originally found him up there. Okay. Anyway, I'm hearing you. So this guy's got two on them. Right there, what do we got? A wood... There's my wood chest. Cool. Okay. Yeah, I still hit that escape every time I think I'm done with something. That's... Too many other games have trained me to do that. Um, Sunken Land. Yeah, Sunken Land broke my brain. It really did. Sunken Land uses F to do everything that this game uses E. So when I would hit E trying to open a chest, yeah, it wouldn't work. But F would open the chest. When I'm in there, I'd hit E to to close the chest, well, in that game, E is take everything, and suddenly all the contents of your chest get slammed into your backpack every single time, and you got to reorganize it all. So I got in the habit of hitting escape to get out of it instead of the same key that I used to get into it. So that seemed like it would be great, but now I'm doing that in this game. <laughs> oh, if only there was a Bible for all games to use these particular keys for in every situation, so there's no confusion for older gamers like me. <laughs> okay, um, too much talking, running out of light. Is there any chance there's a place on this island where we might find some kind of a chest? But I don't want to do it in the dark if there is. Yeah, we always seem to run out of light. Let's, I'm going to go sleep and I'll be right back. Okay. On this island, if there were... There was a place that I would check for a chest under the ground. It'd be here. And it's not. Or maybe over there. None of them, though, look promising to me. This doesn't quite seem like the right kind of place. Nah, it's not. It's not, I don't know, odd enough. Hello, Connor 2. Yeah, that's what Connor looked like, but he was pure white. I thought, I found a different kind of bird. He didn't look like a pheasant. He didn't have any purple or blue or what, any of the other colors on his head. Just white. Anyway, here, there might be something hidden, but I am not seeing it. Yeah... No, well, hmm. No, I don't think so. So let's just kind of fly around a bit. See if there's any, in fact, let's slow down. See if there's anything that kind of catches my eye as being different. We'll peek underneath and see if that... Yeah, nothing over there. Or if there is, I'm not catching it. Okay. All right, let's go underneath. No, it looks pretty normal over here. Okay, so we'll call that island done. And what? Let's go look at our table map. Right through the sail. Okay, so we are right at that edge. I need to see what's over there. Let's go forward just a little bit. Can we see anything right now? Um, uh, a whirlwind over there. Let's see. I got to look at the edge of the screen for things to pull in. It's almost like there's something that's trying to form over there. No, nope. it's like looking through a fisheye lens sometimes. All right, let's go. No, nope. don't go. Turn, turn. 
Ah, oh, there's an island over there on the other side of that whirlwind. Okay, so we'll go there. And we'll see if a whirlwind affects an island. We'll try and go track right through it. All in the name of science. Yeah, that's it. Okay, you're a little close still. I think we're about to touch down there. Yep, we hit. Okay, hold to the side. Forward. Oh, we got more speed now. Yeah, that moved quite quickly away from the island. All right, swinging around. Swinging hard. Let's head right into the middle of this guy and see what happens. Now, we have an elevation. We do. We're at 631. So, we'll see if it does any. There's 632, and I'm not going up. All right. Almost centered. That looks pretty good. A little more this way. And we're in it. 632. And holding. 633. I don't know if that did anything or not. Where'd our island go? Over there. Right? That's not the one we were just at, right? I'm having second doubts here. Let's pull off. Drop. Where am I on the map? We are pointed backward. Did that... That thing didn't spin us around, did it? Okay, what's going on here? Where is the... Whoa! Crash land. Try that again. There we... No. There we go. So up. That's the island we just left. It's gotta be. Okay. So that must be the island we're heading to. It's just that I didn't think it was that far off to our side when we were heading to it. Okay, back over here. Crash. And drop. I'm so glad there's no fall damage. <laughs> I'd have died many times by now. Alright, let's go see if this is in fact the one we were heading toward. Right there. Sails. We are... According to that, we're heading away. We're running back toward this area. Um... Yeah. Okay. We somehow got spun around. Whoa! I wasn't on the wheel yet. I went to turn and I just falling. Get back up here. So you can fly fire, fly faster than your island. Good to know. If you ever lose it, you can catch up. Okay, let's hit the E this time. Then spin around. And we'll slow it down. So... Is that island that we cleansed I think it is where we started the episode okay let's see if the ship on the map starts to turn the other direction now definitely have more speed now I would overtake that long before I finished my turn if I kept going all right there we go. Full speed. Rain is starting. There we go. So heading back toward this one. Yeah, the whirlwind's on the other side now. So that's the one we were just at. This must be the one that we just cleansed. And that's the one we were going to. And what happened? That, that whirlwind didn't give us a 180, did it? Because the whirlwind's on the other side of it, just like we had just taken off from it. That's interesting. So, what's the storm doing to the sails? These guys are happy. He's not happy. I can't see. Well, kind of see. Now, are they not happy because the wind is on this side? Maybe that's what's going on. The wind is shifting. I don't know, but there's the island. 
And that's the one we just went to. That's the one that's got the pheasants on it. Okay. And I can't see the other one anymore. So let's slow down. I honestly don't know where I'm heading. Everything zeroed? Seems to be. Yep. Okay. So now we are heading out properly. Okay. There's one in front of us somewhere. I cannot see it. No, well, those are rocks. Okay. I barely see my own island to get back. It's there, but it is just barely there. Ah, I see sails. I see a windmill dropping in. Okay. Let's get into our hobbit hole and get in where it's dry sometimes. It does sometimes rain in here, though. Yeah, it does. Let's go up top and see if we can... Yeah, it rained right there. Every once in a while, I get the symbol on me that I've just gotten wet. Mm -hmm. Well, let's make the sun come back. Though I'm only guessing it's nighttime. It was stormy. Yeah, it's, I hear birds. Never mind. Let's try that again. Okay, but I'm wet. And the storm's still going. Okay. So what else needs to be done in here? Um, first of all, we're not moving. Let's verify we're, we're in a good place out here. Then we'll spend some time indoors. Yeah. Still in the same spot? Yep. So it might be next episode when we cross the, the meridian there. <laughs> um, we do have a table now, though we don't have a good place. Well, kind of. We could cheat a little bit here. Um, let's see. Let's just grab something and delete you and you. Okay. So we could build... Um, wall, and flip you around disabled. There we go, like so, and shrink you, and shrink you, and shrink you, there, and triangle, which one? Are they all in the same place now? They're all in the same one now. Okay, that changed on me. So keep flipping around till we get to right there. And right there. Okay. So build. That's not a build. Five? There it is. I don't want to carry through and power build. Because I'll end up building all of the railings here. Yeah, I wanted railings, not walls. So... That must have happened before. But this area now could possibly be a place for a table. Right here. Like that. But on top of a rug. Let's see here. Nice designs. I wish they were bigger. I guess we could... Mosaic a couple of things. Oh, what are you? Wait a minute here. What am I seeing? Wool. We need to make wool. Okay, so let's go back. And so your wool curtains and rope tapestries. Okay. Over here... We've got a stone chest. Nice. Wooden chest. Page three now. Okay, back to here. Um, got our trellis. So let's go in. Can I... Are all of these wool? I think they're all wool. Okay. So go back to these guys then. We'll do that for now. We'll, we'll do the, uh, the poor man's rugs. Yep. So you... Uh, Q-E. Right there. 
and there, and then you, right there and there. Okay, now we can go in with a table and tuck it right into the stairs like so, and then chairs. You guys could do that. I was thinking of stools because of the space in here, but could do... Let's put you at a diagonal. That way you're not taking up too much room. You're there, and then a stool there, but I don't know what's front. I think that's front. Meaning when you sit, you can only sit from one side. We'll do that, and this guy will just kind of tuck in a little bit so we can get around him easy. But sit. There we go. Sit at the table. Now, too bad I can't... What do I do? Forward? There we go. Too bad I can't grab a pumpkin pie and sit it down on the on the table. That'd be cool. So, rain has stopped. Rain has stopped. Let's run a little bit long and fly forward. <laughs> Actually, just fly over. Let's just see what this guy is real quick. Alright, simple little island. And nothing special here. Don't see any plants. Gather... Oh, your tomatoes. Okay. So we got tomatoes there and there. Kind of hiding in the... With all the different colors in here. Hmm. Okay, I gotta know. Is there a reason for this guy? There is not. Okay. Put you back. And... Hmm. Let's fly into the next sector next episode. That way it starts the episode and we can explore it, head over to whatever the first thing is that we see. Which way is the island aiming? We are flying that way, so it's pretty much in front of us. So... I don't know. There aren't any islands that are close enough to see. So I would imagine that whole string right there, all those flashes are in that next sector. That would be my guess. And we'll figure it out next time. So, thanks for watching, guys. See you later. Bye-bye.